Well, hello. Uh, this arrived today from Amazon. It's got slightly damaged in the mail. And I thought this would be, at the very moment I heard this announced, I thought this would be ideal for a, a video review on YouTube. This is literally as it arrived, other than I've got it out of the box from Amazon. So, this is a, an unboxing and a review. So we shall get the scissors at it. And you're seeing this for the first time, and I'm seeing this for the first time, so inside of the box. Ah! For God's sake! The inside of the box is an exciting sort of yellowy colour, and there's a few details on the back. And this is a an app-related Sonic screwdriver we've got also inside huh. this is an, an interesting and unexpected freebie and worth sticking on the wall it's a poster of the 13th Doctor not huge, about A4 in size and what I would call the sort of photograph that is um, photoshopped to within an inch of their life, but helpful all the same. So this is the third sonic screwdriver I own. I own the, uh, I, mean, I think this is character options, but you know this is wow stuff. So this is the third supplier of sonics. Now, presumably it just comes straight out. Ah, now that's interesting. Hopefully, you can hear that, it is probably made out of metal. And when you press the button underneath, it lights up very brightly. And I have to look into the instructions for this, because apparently there's an app. It doesn't twist, like the other replicas do, but it... It's got a comforting weight to it, and there's an interesting texture too to the um, plastic. It has a sort of... It feels a bit more like a prop and a bit less like a toy. Uh, hopefully you can see some of the details there. But uh, and there is an app related to this. I'm not sure how you get this app. It just says, comes with a free to download app. Available on iOS and Android. Draw with light is written in very large friendly letters on the back there. But it doesn't say anywhere what this app is called. There's no instruction leaflet. There's nothing written on the box to say what it's called, so let's just leave that there a sec. And while you're looking at that, I'm going to fire up the iOS App Store and see what I can find. So it's called Light Painting Sonic Screwdriver. So let's go on the iOS App Store and we will type in Light Painting. Ah, well stuff light painting app. So uh, that is in the iOS app store. So what does it say if we click on that? Fully featured light painting app, manual automatic exposure and ISO settings. A maximum control, built-in flashlight, timed recording functions, save images to your camera roll. I don't know if that's the app. Light painter, light space. Yeah, that top one, however, is the only one. 
from WoW's stuff, so I guess that's it. So we'll hit download on that, and we'll see if my Wi-Fi wants to play ball. Oh, this was meant to be a stable camera setup. That is now downloading. And that was very can't be a very big app because it's already downloaded. Uh, I want to access the camera. See, I'm not sure how the app relates to the product. This is where things get a bit strange. So, to the human eye, that's to the human eye that is white, to the app it's green. That turns the light on and off. Ah! I get what it does. I am familiar with this as a sort of time exposed photography. So if you hit... It's now recording. What it does is it's taking a timed exposure and then so if we want to delete that so what I'm going to do is going to require an edit in the video here so let's just stop and we'll retrain the camera on the ceiling now the ceiling did not prove to be the answer so we're here now in the dark and this app works best if you can be at a distance from it so that is the phone that you can see in the dark and I have the Sonic in my hand so now I can do this and oh, it cut out before I could do another one but if I head over you'll see what it's doing is it's taking a, a time exposure and allowing you to draw through the image that it's recording so we'll, we'll give it another go and have it on a 10 second countdown and then it records for 16 seconds that's what I was trying to achieve and hopefully that will focus on it. I mean, you get the idea. It's actually quite fun to use. But the biggest problem with it is you need to be a certain distance away from your device where the app is running. So there you are. That is the light drawing sonic screwdriver. Here's a couple of example images, both of them shot indoors. And I think the second one's slightly more successful than the first.